everyone in this video we are going to see the next type of your puzzle question there are eight boxes a b c d e f g and h are placed one above the another but not necessarily in the same order there are four boxes placed between d and g so we can consider first second third fourth fifth sixth seven h so if i am placing D is here means G will be here. If I am placing D is here means G will be 1, 2, 3, 4. G will be here and all. And then two boxes are placed between B and G. So B is here means there are two boxes between B and G. After that number of boxes between A and G is same as between H and B. A and G we don't know where is A. Two boxes are placed between A and H. C, A and H and A is placed above G. A is placed above G. Okay. Now, two boxes are placed between A and H. C is placed just above G. C. There are at least two boxes between E and B. At least two boxes. So, E e will be here so e and b there are two boxes now one more point is there a is placed above g so a is coming here and there are number of boxes between a and g is two bo three boxes one two three three boxes and same as the between h and b where is h if i'm placing h is here means one two Three, there are three boxes equal spaces after that there are at least two boxes between E and B right how many boxes are between boxes E and A so only one box option B is the correct answer we'll move on to your next question eight boxes a, B, C, D, E, G, H and F are placed one above another but not necessarily in the same order. No two boxes according to alphabetical order are order placed adjacent to each other. A is not placed just above and below P. So according to the alphabet they are not coming in the alphabetical order. <coughs> Box A is placed at second position either from the top or bottom. So 8 boxes 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So there are second position E will be coming here or else E will be coming here. From top to bottom we don't know that anyway we can consider like this only two boxes between F and C. F and C having two boxes between them after that sorry after that box d is placed just below f so just below f means d will be coming here box d is placed box d is placed above c now b is placed above c okay now only one box is placed between c and g so C and G, I need to place only one box. Only one box is placed between C and G. So if I'm placing C is here means only one box is placed between C and G. G is here, only one box. So the above C is B and above D is above B is D and D F and C having two persons. E is the second position. R L C will be coming here. Now one more point. Only one box is placed between C and G. That's all. And any other condition is available? No. So according to your question, C B. It is possible to placing C B and all? No. We want to place this is B and this is D. So if I am placing here D means it comes in the alphabetical order. So hence what they said. So we can keep it here D B. We want to change C is here and F is here. So if F is here means E will not coming here. So hence E will be coming here. Second place E will be coming C. C and this will be not D. It will be yes. So if I am placing C is here means I need to place D is here. 
so and c d g and only one one box is between g and f here f is here means d will be coming here and e will not coming here e will be placed here and one more one more box is the box is there b now your question is which of the following box is placed at top so which is not available here a hence a is the right answer Okay, we'll move on to your next question. Eight people A, B, C, D, E, F, G and H live in an eight story building but not necessarily in the same order. The lowermost floor is numbered 1 and the topmost floor is numbered 8. So, the previous cases and all we can start 1 to 8 but in this case we want to start 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. 1. Now, the, listen, now the lower most floor is numbered 1 and the top most floor is numbered 8. So, according to this question, A lives on an even numbered floor. A lives on an even numbered floor. So, even numbers, what are the even numbers? 8, 6, 4, 2. The possible chances are A will be living in this any of the four floors, any one of the four floors. After that, numbered but not on the floor number second and fourth. Second is not coming and fourth is not coming. Anyway, two numbered are available here. After that, only three flows are there between A and B. Only three flows are between A and B means if I am placing A is here means only three persons between A and B. So, if I am placing A is here means only three persons between A and B. Am I right? Only two people live between C and A. So, C and E. Only two people between C and E. So, if I am placing C is E here means E will be here. Two persons are there. Just I am placing like this. After that, F lives on the floor above D. F lives on the floor above D. Okay. Now, there are equal number of flows between the flows on which E and B lives and between the flows on which A and E lives. A and E having two number of flows between them. The same value which is equal to E and B. So here E and B means it is not coming here. If I am placing E is here means. So it is not possible to come the floor. Anyway I need to change. If E is coming here means. Uh, there is a two flows between E and C. Am I right? So, if I am placing C is here means there is no two flows here. Now, I can cancel it. I can place a C is here means there are two flows between. Sorry, it is not possible. So, the diagram is not possible. We will move on to the, we'll move on to the next diagram. 8th one, 7th one, 6th one, 5th one. 4th one, 3rd one, 2nd one, 1st one. So, 8th one, if I am placing A is here means A lives on an even numbered floor and on, but on an odd floor number 2nd and 4th only 3 floors are there between A and B. If I am A is placing here means 1, 2, 3. 4th place will be going to B. Only 2 people live between C and E. So, only two people between live between C and E. So, if I am placing C is here means E will be here. Hence, only F lives on the on a floor above D. F lives on the floor above D. That's all. After that, there are equal number of flows between the flows on which E and B. One floor is there. If I am placing means and the flows on A and E. Yes, A, if I am placing E is here means there are only one person between and similarly A and E having only one person. So, therefore C will be coming here and F will be coming here, G will be coming here and after that H lives immediately below D's floor. So, H lives immediately below D's floor. Hence, 
I can place D is here. After D, H will be lives. Though floor F will be before F. F will be coming here or here. After that, G lives immediately below A floor. There is G will be here. Therefore, F will be coming here. So, hence your question is how many flows are there between B and D? How many flows are there between B and D? Only one floor. Answer option B is the correct answer. Now, this is the floor based puzzles in this video. Thank you for watching.